All right, guys, our problem today is the position of an object in feet is given by s equals t squared plus 4. And our t is in seconds, and it's asking us to find the average velocity. So uh, for this problem here, it's asking us, it's telling us that our time difference is only 0.1 seconds. It's going from 1.1 1 .1, uh, to 1.0 seconds. So to do this problem, you pretty much have to incorporate those times into this formula right here, which is our change in s divided by our change in time. As you can see, uh, just to show that a little bit more, I plugged them in to the formula. Now, the change in s is going to be this function with the final time, which in this case is 1.1, minus that same function with the initial time, which is 1.0. So I can show that a little bit more. I wrote it out for you, and it's, um, it's going to be 1.1 squared plus 4. And that's subtracted by our initial time incorporated into that function, which is 1.0 squared plus 4. And that's all over our change in time, which is 1.1 minus 1.0. Now, when we come down a little bit, it's uh, I worked that out a little bit by squaring those two numbers, and we get 1.21 plus 4, and that's subtracted by 1 plus 4. And this is still all over our change in time, which is 1.1 minus 1.0. So when we come down here, we're right here now, uh, we get 5.21 minus 5, and this is still all, this is all over our change in time, which is 0.1. So when that's worked out, we get 0 0.21 divided by 0.1, and that solved is 2.1, and that is our average velocity. To recap, all we did was we took this formula, we incorporated our final and initial values, subtracted them out, we did a little basic algebra down here, and that gave us our answer. 2.1 is our initial or our average velocity for that problem.